hi guys in this video i am going to show you how you can play silent hill downpour on your pc without problems and crashes i will also show you how you can fix red screen main menu problem in this game first i will show you the problem and then i will fix it now let's go to the configurations right click silent hill downpour and click change custom configuration in cpu tab everything is at default settings now let's go to the gpu tab here you can see I have changed this resolution scale. I am going to run this game at 4K but you can set this resolution scale according to your desire. But in my case there is no performance gain while decreasing the resolution. And resolution scale threshold is also important for many games. It fixes the pixelated problems in different games and it requires different values for different games. First I will show you the problem and then I will show you what is its purpose and how it works. I am also using vSync to lock my FPS according to my monitor's refresh rate. Now let's go to the audio tab. Here everything is also at default settings, IO, system and network. These three tabs are not important. Now let's go to the advanced tab. Here we need to change this V blank frequency. To 120 hertz this 120 hertz mean our game will run at 60 fps now let's go to the emulator tab here everything is also at default settings now click apply save custom configuration now let's go to the controller settings click this pads option here here we can see different options select keyboard if you want to play any game on keyboard Select DualShock 3 for PS3 controller, DualShock 4 for PS4 controller and select X input for Xbox controller. I am going to select X input because I am using Xbox 360 controller to play this game. Now you can see as I am moving both the sticks on my controller, in the bottom right corner both dots are also moving. It means that controller is working perfectly. Now click save. Now it's time to show you some game patches. To download game patches, go to manage. Now click game patches. Here you can see I have already downloaded Silent Hill Dawn for game patch. You can click this download latest patches button down here to download new patches for different games. Now let's open this patch. The first thing we need to do right now is to match this games patch version with our installed game the serial number of our installed game is blus30565 and the patch serial number is blus30565 and our games version is 01.01 .01 and patch version is also 01.01 .01. it means now we can apply patches and here is only one patch for this game simply Click this button to apply this unlock FPS patch. Click apply. Now click save. Now let's boot this game. Boot with custom configuration. Now click anywhere at this window for full screen. Here we can see this is the problem with this game's main menu. Everything is red. Now I will show you how you can fix it. And now close it. change custom configuration now let's go to the GPU tab and this option is the key to solve this problem simply set this option to 512 by 512 we need to set 512 by 512 here now this is the key to solve this problem now click apply save custom configuration now boot it again with custom configuration
now here we go now we have fixed our red screen problem now press the start button to begin load game bus crash site okay You can hear me, give me a shout. Hello? Can anyone hear me? What they were doing here at night? Let's see. What were they doing here? Oh no, this is very cruel crow, hey, stay away from that man, he was sleeping here this didn't happen in the and accident. you have destroyed him, oh no, poor man, what you was doing here? Be careful, be careful. This is very dangerous place. This is crazy. Oh no. I am curious now who has put tree here. Oh no. Let's go, let's go. Don't stop here. This is not a good place to stop or stay. Come on, come on. Yeah. Oh no. I think Sri was waiting for him. Now let's go upside. 